Hi everybody, I'm just experimenting with something today, so I won't figure it, I'll just go live to show you. I had a few extra minutes before we have to go to my daughter's musical today, but I just wanted to try this because I got my blue butterfly tea. I hope you can see this okay. Um, but I wanted to try to make a cocktail with it. I'm not gonna drink it this early in the day, don't worry, but I just wanted to experiment with this stuff, or maybe I will drink a little bit of it, just to taste it, to make sure it's good. But I just wanted to try this tea out. So I brewed, I just took one tea bag, I'm just gonna show you what the tea bags look like for the blue butterfly tea. And this says, I, it's, uh, it has sweet orange peels, blue pea flowers, sweet orange flowers, apple pieces, hibiscus flowers, ginger root, and licorice root. So, smells delicious. But um, I just brewed it and then dumped a whole mug of tea over ice to chill it to make this cocktail. And if you're not a drinker, you don't have to add the alcohol that I'm gonna add, but it just looks fun. Um, I just wanna put this white envelope behind here so you can see the purple that it is. It's a nice dark purple color. What I'm gonna do first is, I'm gonna make a martini. So I have a martini glass, and I'm going to take some of my summer berry and rim the glass. Oh, let me put this so you guys can see what I'm doing here instead of seeing me. <laughs> All right, the summer berry is really good. If you haven't tried this one, I like putting it on yogurt, oatmeal, anything. So it makes a really good dip too. For fruit okay so I just sprinkled some of that summer berry on here so I can rim the glass so it'll be nice and pretty I'm just gonna put the lemon around here so it has something to stick to all right Let's see I'm just gonna you guys can see what I'm doing here I'm just gonna Put the summer berry all around the edge. Hopefully this works out okay. This is my first time trying this. I'm just creating a recipe out of my head here for this. Ooh, that looks pretty. The glass is nice and rimmed with the summer berry. And the summer berry smells so good. It's really delicious. Okay, so now I'm just gonna add, and I did brew, like this is how much tea I got out of that. And it's, see that nice dark purple that it is? And you're gonna see the really cool thing about this tea. This blue butterfly tea changes color. So I'm gonna add just, I don't know, like half of the martini glass or more with the blue butterfly tea. And this kind of smells like, let me just taste it without the alcohol in it first. Ooh, that's good. It's almost like a little bit grape tasting to me. I don't know if it's just cause it's purple, but it is orange. Maybe it's the blue pea flowers that make it have a grapey taste. And it has, it does have apple in it. So it's a little bit of an apple flavor. It's really good in summary. All right, so now what I'm gonna do, so this is in here. I'm just gonna add a little bit of, I'm gonna use the citrus vodka, but you can use whatever you want. I mean, you don't even have to add alcohol to this if you don't drink. It's fine, it'll still be fun. All right, I'm gonna add, I don't know how much vodka I wanna add, I'll just add probably a whole shot. It is a martini. There, so, okay. And now I'm going to add, I'm gonna get my citrus juicer and hopefully you can see this and I will show you. But look at this color beforehand before I add the citrus. I just want you to see the nice dark purple that it is. And I'm going to add some lemon to this. And you could use like a berry vodka, that would probably be good. Or anything that you want. You could put tequila in this. Okay, I'm gonna add my citrus and show you the color change. Hopefully you can see that, oh, it's turning pink. It's so fun, look how pink that is now. So fun, it's a good party trick. Look at it. Fun stuff, I mean, kids would even like this, minus the vodka, of course, but it would be a fun little drink to make for your kids, just with the tea or iced tea, or if they do like hot tea on a chilly day like today in Pennsylvania, you might wanna keep it a hot drink. But that's just a cute little cocktail you can make for your summer parties. The summer berry 
And there, we also have a tutti fruity, one of these toppers that would be really cute to, to rim the glass with. And the blue butterfly tea. So I just wanted to show you that quick little cocktail. Okay, I will taste it, even though it's early in the day, but you know, I just had time now, that's why I'm making this. I don't typically drink cocktails at, what time is it, 11 a.m., but I'm gonna taste it so you guys know what it tastes like. Ooh, that is really good. And it's not overly strong, because I only added one ounce of vodka. You can add more if you want it stronger, but maybe this is okay to have at 11 o'clock because it wasn't that strong. All right, there's a pretty little summer drink for you. If you have any questions, let me know. If you would like to book a summer party, let me know. I can be happy to come over and do a tasting for you if you're local. And um, if you would like to have an online party, those are also super easy. All right, guys, have a good weekend. Cheers. It won't turn off. Cheers again.